Welcome back everybody, we got the Vivitar, it's a drone. Today's video is about the Vivitar drone and my thoughts about it. And it's probably everybody's reviews gonna be totally different than mine. That's just my opinion, they like it. That is, I'm gonna tell you what I like about it and what I don't like about it. For starters, I'm gonna just tell you what I don't like about this drone. Okay, I don't like that this cheap antenna it, it's just too cheap. It's plastic. It breaks off. I've had to put this pin back in here. Okay, you can put the pin back in. It is a pain in the butt. Okay, if my cameraman comes closer, he can see this right there. But anyway, in all in all, okay. All right, so the Vivitar is a 2.4 gigahertz. Okay, this is not an Altahoot. Uh, altitude hold drone, okay? Because if it was an altitude hold drone, the stick would be here and be flimsy, see? Like this one. But all in all, the controller, I like how big it is. I, I like the way it feels. I just don't like the antenna. And it's it's not that, it's not a heavy controller. It's really, really fairly light. But anyway, to the drone aspect of it, okay? Uh... I don't remember what the milliamps is on this battery, but we'll find out here. Uh, it's got a three point volt, and it's a 650 milliamp, which is not a very long battery. This is probably roughly about 12 to 13 minutes, okay? This is a Walmart drone, okay? You can get it for 80 bucks, 79.99. No, actually $79 even. So all together you pay about 84 bucks. If you want, uh, I'm not going to leave this link in the description about this drone because you only can buy it one place. Walmart. But in my opinion, I don't like it. This is what I don't like about it. This is styrofoam. So if it's really windy outside, I don't care. If it's, it don't even have to be really windy. It just got to have a little wind. It will push every direction every single direction so it does not do well at night i mean in the wind at night what the frick am i thinking guys excuse me anyway in the wind okay so anyway but i like the way uh is this a beginner drone no it is not it's got a nice camera on it only thing i don't like about it i'm gonna try to figure out if anybody has any ideals how to uh, put your other videos with another video of this video, if that makes any sense. I want to know how to add my video to this video of the uh, camera, okay, for this. So that way you can see actually what it looks like. But since you can't see it on my channel, uh, just look up this same drone and there's video quality, but some of their cameras is not very good. But anyway, um... I don't have a very good software thing because I don't know what to use because they actually took it off the free one. Unlike some people, I'm not rich. So, I mean, if anybody has any idea how to do this, please leave the, uh, uh, the comments down below. So that way it helps me out too as a YouTuber. If you want better videos from me, uh, I need to know what's a good software to use that I don't have to pay an arm and leg, like two, $300 is what I mean. I want something good enough, it's simple, and uh, stuff like that. But anyway, back to the video. But it's fairly light, okay? And the motors are on the, underneath the here, okay? Which I like this because it should always have a cover on this motor. The, uh, the gears should not be exploited like they are here because for the simple fact, all this dirt and debris gets up in here mud or anything if an accidentally you know whatever but the props are awesome i like them okay and but it's pretty durable i think i cracked it a little bit uh the little thing when i first got it but you probably don't want to hear me stop freaking talking but anyway uh, i'm gonna put this battery back in and i'll show you how it flies indoors because right now you wouldn't be able to see it outside uh well, you can see it outside, but I don't know what your guys' local laws are, but they said I could get in trouble 
because I'm in Indiana, they said that I can get in trouble for flying this at nighttime. So if anybody has any information of that, leave the comments down below because I really like to know because I don't know how to look up the laws for these things. And if the RC sailors, or if you guys are watching that, uh, watching this video, please uh, give me uh, a way to figure how to find out the laws about these. Because I really don't know. Only thing I do know, you only can allowed to fly these up to 400 feet in this region. That's the only thing I can tell you. Other than that, I don't know. Who would want to fly 400 feet? Anyway, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to take uh, side off the camera here and... Watch the drone here. Here we go. It's bound now. So, like I said, it's really awesome. It's got like a 30% and 60%. If you put it in 100%, it just don't fly very good. It does this, I hope, like the time. It just keeps doing flips over and over. I didn't used to be this good at these drones. I've lost a drone, which was the, uh, I forget, uh, Ava. Matter of fact, since I've already got the paper here, I'll just, it's called, this is the drone that I lost, guys, okay? This is what it's called. I think it's AVAX, AVAX H2O. Uh, cameraman, what does that say? H2O AVX. AVX. I, I knew it was something like that. It's a weird name, guys. But anyway, this is what I lost. It's definitely not a beginner drone, okay? And this one is not a beginner drone neither, okay? This is a beginner drone. $55 at Walmart, okay? And this is, has altitude hold. If you guys want to see a review on this drone, which is a Sky Viper, leave the comments down below and let me know. All right. Back to this video. Okay. But like I said, it's really awesome because you can fly this inside or outside. But if I preferably say if you've never flew one before, do not fly it in your living room, okay? Because it's really awesome. I love it. I'm going to do a flip for you. Awesome flip. Just beautiful flip. Okay. All right. Well. I hope you guys like this video, and I hope to see you back at my channel. If you like what you see, uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.